Welcome to Health Source of Normal Illinois. Today's topic, how does spinal decompression work? In the past, the only treatment for a herniated disc was surgery and medication. More recently, more people are turning to non-surgical spinal decompression as an alternative to the highly invasive and very risky surgeries performed in the past. While physical therapy and surgery give back pain sufferers some small degree of relief, for the most part, those who had a herniated disc were forced to live with the pain for the rest of their lives, even after surgery was performed. However, spinal decompression is less risky and is proving to have better results. What is spinal decompression? In the beginning, it was known as spinal traction. Spinal traction differed slightly and was not as effective. In fact, some reports show that it actually made the problems worse. However, spinal decompression solved the problems of traction and is now making herniated disc problems disappear. How does spinal decompression work? Spinal decompression uses reverse disc pressure known as distraction. It slowly stretches the back and gradually stretches the muscles. All of this prevents the muscles going into a spasm. The machines are FDA approved to monitor the patients during the entire process. Most patients report remarkable results and do not report any complications. Who does spinal decompression? Many chiropractors do non-invasive spinal decompression. However, there is more to consider than just the treatment alone. This should only be one component of the healing process. Machines are just that, machines. Only a human can determine the need for spinal decompression. How does spinal decompression work? The patient lies on a table and straps are gently placed on the neck or back. Then, an FDA-approved machine slowly manipulates the joints by putting reverse pressure on the joints. This is known as distraction. The process is offset by periods of rest. It generally takes several sessions to complete the process. What are the effects of spinal decompression? After you receive non-surgical spinal decompression, the disc has a chance to slip back into place. Since the pressure that was being placed on the joint is no longer there, the swelling goes down and everything gently glides back to normal. Spinal decompression, when combined with progressive rehab, has been proven very effective with slipped, bulging, and herniated discs. What other factors should be considered? Anytime you look for a chiropractor, seek out a chiropractor that is involved in progressive rehab. Progressive rehab takes a holistic approach into the healing of a person. It combines the newest chiropractic techniques with age-old philosophies. You are guaranteed to find a chiropractor that will consider your entire body. How do I find a chiropractor? Finding the right chiropractor is of utmost importance as your back affects your everyday life. You do not want to trust it to just anyone. That's why you need to make sure your chiropractor does progressive rehab. Progressive rehab is a specialized therapy that combines traditional chiropractic techniques with modern